Okay, so we've established what the personality is of your business. You've reminded yourself about everything about your products, your service, your customer care. You've got that in one big list. The next part that we want to look at is your passion. Um, there is a reason, or there should be a reason, why you do the job that you do, why you've started your own business, why you work as part of something, why you have a particular hobby that you want people to know about. This is looking at everything in a kind of very holistic way. So what I want you to write down is all the things that you care about. What is your passion? Why do you love something that you do? Many people call me a weirdo, quite rightly, for a variety of reasons, probably some of which you're thinking of. But uh, I collect trainers, and I collect rare Adidas trainers, and it's a huge passion of mine. I know all the different websites, I know when releases are coming up, I know what I like about design. Uh, I'm very quick to judge designs that I don't like. Um, that is my passion, that's what I want to put across. In a more kind of business sense, a huge passion of mine is customer service. And I mean down to lots of little details, like um, people not telling me when they're going to get back to me. Um, and we've transferred a lot of that into Thinkit, a lot of the passions that I have. So we have a communications platform that encourages people and says well done when they've achieved something. That's a passion that you want to put across. My view is that everybody wants to know that somebody's thinking of them. And that is often missing from a customer service point of view. So that's a big passion of mine. I want people to know if they're using Thinkit that we appreciate it, that we like what they're doing. Um, so that's the passion part of it. So create a list. Um, and a lot of the five pieces about creating lists and we will wrap it together at the end about what to do with that and how to harmonize it into a kind of social media marketing plan but write down all the things that you care about because quite often we don't put them across in our business they're kind of there but we kind of forget about it and let's not forget that social media is about personality and it's about people so in the next part we're going to look at the people side of things